Okay. Eat I'm excanathony. Good morning. It is early a.m., about quarter after five on moon day, the 23rd of March, 2020. Going into the lunar cycle, Sa'aki, some the duck moon. And Chelsea and I have awoken once again in San Jose, Costa Rica. But today, this morning, we are here at SJO, the international airport. We have boarding passes, we've been through security, and we have a flight that's on time that's gonna take us to Newark, New Jersey. We're gonna spend the day in Newark, hop on another flight tonight to Toronto, spend the night in Toronto, hop on another flight in the morning to Calgary, and drive home. It's gonna be an ordeal, day and a half of travel, but at least it's travel. Yeah, we're getting out of getting out of this country, going home. Very happy. And then we get like two weeks off. <laughs> off from our vacation and from work. So um, yeah, we'll see how the how the ordeal goes. San Jose to Lethbridge. They got Chels pulled aside for some kind of random uh, security thing here. Caught back up with her. <laughs> Did they molest you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You may be asked to assist the crew during an evacuation. If you are unable or uncomfortable performing exit row functions and assisting an emergency, please ask the flight attendant to be moved. If you must evacuate the aircraft, exit pad lights on or near the floor will illuminate and guide you. Kind of, we got a lot of time to kill in the Newark airport. It was really hard to get to our gate for me because uh, because of my embassy ID. The guys, the TSA guys, they like had to do some call center thing and uh, make sure I am who I am. So I had to I had to like recite from memory my childhood address. <laughs> With the zip code, you know, my social insurance and my social security number in the US, all this stuff that's like I haven't I've been lived in the US since I was like 22, 23 years old, something like that. Um it was a mess and I imagine it's still gonna be a mess when we get to Toronto because our it wouldn't if it, if our flight was like tonight to Calgary from Toronto, but because it's not till the morning. I think we're gonna face issues. In fact, I don't know. I don't even know if we're if our check bag is coming in bag luggage claim there. If we, uh, I'm, I'm afraid to go to luggage claim because then you go outside the terminal and then getting back to the TSA guys is ridiculous. Anyway, now we're walking around. We're kind of looking for somewhere to eat. But look at this. Like this is where normally, you know people who are flying with stop and eat these restaurants and stuff they got all closed off like like it's any better for us to uh to mingle over you know in these other common areas than it is to just eat in the restaurant areas i don't know 
We'll find something. <laughs> Some munchies. Oh yeah, we got a little food court here. This'll do. This'll do. One of these. All right, we're gonna stop and eat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be cold whips for a little bit here. We have to acclimatize again. <laughs> All right, plane number two going to Toronto. Here we go. Going to Canada, going home. Oh, we're in Toronto. We are. In our hotel room. <laughs> Cushy, first world life is back again. <laughs> Uh, but Costa Rica, we will be back. Yeah. We'll be back someday and we'll be way more prepared. We're not going to get flying knee to the head right out the, <laughs> <laughs> right out the gate. No. Not next time. We're going to do it better. But we're not going to go right away. We got we got other other places we're going to yeah. we're going to go. <laughs> you know, we got to take the kids next year. Yeah. The year after that, I think we're going to go to Vietnam. The year after that, we got to take the kids again. Maybe 4 years out. Maybe, Maybe four years out. I don't know. We're thinking about Argentina too. Okay. So, so we'll see. We'll see. But someday, Costa Rica, we're going to have our rematch. <laughs> we'll put up a fight then. <laughs> we will. We will. We'll be like that. Well, we did, did. We did, did. I mean, yeah. Yeah, we got the fly in knee. We, <laughs> we, were, we were on the mat. We were fucked up, but we got it. We were we got on our feet and stuff. We we struggled, you know. We made it. Yeah. We made it happen. We kept we kept going. We kept going, and you know, it looked like we were kind of turning things around. I mean, it, the fight was never in our favor. It's never in our favor. No, no. But <laughs> no. but you know, all all in all, like we survived it. You know, right? We survived it. We learned, and we're gonna regroup, retrain. You know. <laughs> come back at it with some new skills and we'll see how it is next time around <laughs> um but anyway we're we're feeling so good uh when we walked into the into the customs at, at the toronto airport airport i was ready to get like because at newark twice i got pulled aside in the back room and interrogated <laughs> And to try to like, you know, sort out my identity and all that shit. Um, when we got to Toronto, I, that's what I was expecting. You know, we got yeah. we got pulled like right away. They said, don't do, you we couldn't go through the normal customs. We had to go over through custom immigrations over this way. And we went up to the desk and I was like, ah, oh, all right, here's my document. Let me tell you what happened. Let me tell you my story. And the, and the guy, the immigration officer said, uh, are are you are you both Canadian citizens? Yes. So, yeah. So I don't need to hear your story. Yeah, like, <laughs> it was like I said. Well, I need a copy of this document. He said, Yeah, I know. I'm gonna, I'll give you, give you a copy. I'll stamp it. You're good to go tomorrow. Oh. We're 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 gonna be fine. So we're, we're happy. We are. It's it, we're happy. But you know, it's not like it's not like we fled. We no. did not flee. <laughs> Even though we got the flying knee to the head, we you know. We stuck it out. We stuck it out, you know. But but uh, yeah, tomorrow we'll be home, home, and um, we well. That'll be part of this video too. But that'll be that'll be our <laughs> San Jose to Lethbridge. Right now we're just feeling so good because we're we're back in in an area where everybody's nice to us and. Um, Nobody's, Normal. nobody's like we, we're not worried about anybody stealing our stuff no. every time we turn our heads or, yeah, crazy. It's, it's crazy. But, you know, that's what it's all about, man. If you don't, <laughs> if you don't get out of your comfort zone and go somewhere where, you know, there's a little resistance, where, how are you going to grow? Yeah. Right? So we'll be home tomorrow. <laughs> Ethomic Skanathony. Good morning. It is Tuesday, 23rd of March. Sa'at Gisum. 
and we are in Toronto's Pearson International Airport. Getting ready to take our last bump, our last ride home. We'll be in the Calgary, Wilkins, just around 10, 10 30, something like that. And a couple hours later, after bailing our truck out of the garage, <laughs> um, we'll be home. Yeah, Chelsea, Chelsea's sister, Alicia, is coming, bringing me one of my truck keys, given that mine was stolen. <laughs> I, I like to keep repeating that. And yeah, we're gonna go home. We're gonna see Polly. We're gonna see Derek. We're gonna see Oscar. The kids aren't allowed to see us. It's vicious. It's vicious. But we'll be really close, and they'll know that, and that's gonna be better. Yeah, we're gonna. We have to do 14 days of quarantine. So we're gonna have our buddies bringing over some foods and some other things. <laughs> yeah, we got some care packages lined up. Um, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good to be home. And, you know, isolation doesn't mean we can't go to the coolies. Can't do, you know, we just gotta keep our distance from the humans. So I'm actually looking forward to it. <laughs> um, yeah, stay tuned. We'll, we'll be in Calgary soon. People are taking the um, coronavirus more and more serious. Pretty soon we're all going to be walking around in hazmat suits. <laughs> I'll be at work. Yeah, you will be, hey? Goodness. Ah, yes, here we go. Boarding the last plane. Going home. Hey, big boy. Hey, big boy. Oh. Hey, big boy. Oh. He's so oh. bad. Oh, my poor. Oh. oh, my poor. Oh, my poor. Oh, I know. Goodness. I know. I know, my boy. Oh. <laughs> hey, Mr. Bird. Hey, Derek. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming. Oh, it's all dark down here for you. Oh. What it? Hey, baby bird. Hey, baby bird. How's you and Oscar? Hey. Oh, there's my bird. There's my handsome. There's my handsome. You wanna come? You wanna come? Come here. Not yet, huh? Not yet. All right. Are you surviving, Oscar? <laughs> hey, the Oscar. You got no water. Gee whiz. All right. All right, you guys. We be home. Oh. Polly boy. My Polly boy. <laughs> My poor baby boy. <laughs> Oh, he's cute. Oh, my boy. I know. I know, my boy. We're home. We're home now. Yes, I miss you so much. What? What? What?
What's up? Derek finally agreed to come up. And now he's getting mad because we're in the kitchen out of his sight. He likes us to sit right in here so he can watch us. So, Chelsea's sister Chantel brought mm -hmm. us. Oh, and Jennifer. And Jennifer, right? Eh? Mm -hmm. Brought us a, uh, basically a care package mm -hmm. extraordinaire. So what do we all got? We got milk. We got some fruit. Um, we got meat stuff. Stack of meat. Bacon, chicken, some Burger, flank, flank. Mm. and some steaks. Oh man, they bought better for us than we did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> some veggies. Oh, celery, flour, broccoli, celery. And like yeah. Yeah, more veggies. So like, oh goodness. Oh. Oh, great. Strawberries, strawberries, carrots, carrots. Ooh. holy moly, and then some apples, which I'm in the middle of eating one. Yeah. Wow, we're, we're good, yeah, and, and some juice. chips, which I just broke into. That's why we're doing this video because I'm like, I gotta show this to everybody. Got bananas, some bread, mm -hmm. yeah, and toilet paper, yeah, we're good on toilet paper. <laughs> you want you want to say your part? Hmm? What it? What it? What are you doing? What are you doing? You got the hooky bill. You haven't cracked off the hooky bill. Do I got to get a Dremel tool? Hmm? Big uh, sand grinder thing. Hey, grinder wheel. <gasps> Proof. The <laughs> Ever impossible to get now right. toilet paper. Oh, these animals are so happy we're home. And we would just be whole if the occupants of that room there yeah. were here to join us, but they cannot join us for 14 days, you know, because yeah. yeah. My plants almost all survived. <laughs> My tomatoes, everything was dry, but. Um, I never really gave good plant instructions, so I guess it's my dilemma. I lost one, this guy here, who was probably a kale, and onion is not looking so good. Potatoes. But potatoes, which we just planted before we left, went big shoots. So we gotta put some more soil in there tomorrow or whenever we got a lot of we, we got a lot of time to do projects <laughs> we might go do some work in the studio because there's no class so we could still be isolated being in the studio mr birds yeah yeah you want to come down you come down <laughs> All right, well, that's, that's okay. Got an order coming anyway. <laughs> We're home. <laughs>